you guys, it's Minu Nighty 2 for Productive Gamers, and today I'm going to be finishing off the Visual Basic Operating System, showing you around everything, um, as it's basically all finished now. I just had a problem with Internet Explorer, just like starting to spam my computer for some reason, even though I've never used it, uh, but that's going crazy. So just a quick uh, look around the applications, here's all the normal ones, uh, all the same stuff as I had on before, the internet, that's just normal. Text to speech, that's still as it should be. Mm -hmm. uh, the media app, yeah, that's all still here. And basically, all of the applications are exactly the same. Um, I may make them all editable just before, uh, I mean, uh, the forms like movable because LL wrote, uh, LL wrote, I think that's his name, he uh, told me how, how you could um, make forms movable when you don't have the window sort of back, uh, layout on them, so I might uh, try that thing out. Uh, what other stuff we got, the task manager, all of that, still as it is, the sound recorder as well. You'll see that I've got the uh, German German uh, translations on the minute, I can swap that back around. I, I did change the calculator because some of the buttons didn't work initially, so I had to uh, sort of redo it all. But now these ones are just normal, so it's not scientific anymore, but it never was in the first place because the buttons didn't work. Uh, these wallpapers, I think these were on last time. And also the t uh, taskbar opacity, as you see on the top, it gradually goes up and down. Um, oh. And then the updater, that's, that's still exactly the same. I'm not sure if I'll ever actually update this without making a completely different version, but uh, we'll see. Now if you look up by the system bar, just up here, the um, the FR, that means French, uh, I'm going to have to translate two of up like this. Um, if you notice it, now it goes to DE for Germany and EN for UK. So you can have all of these things and the help as well, I've just got this. Add a little bit more to it, uh, just so you know what's what's going on there. The clock still as normal, and this calendar, the standard Windows one. Um, we've still got the sleep menu and the restore system, but that does change the backgrounds, which is a bit weird. But one thing that I have fixed is the bug. Um, you can now uh, some of the settings will save when you turn it off. Uh, and you t if you turn your computer off as well, I think it should save. Uh, that's only some of them though, not all of them are at that stage. But if I um, just put something like that on, in French, and then you'll see that this goes to French, but these two buttons don't, and I, I don't know why at the moment. But the sort of the whole creation thing is still the same. And yeah. I'm probably not going to do any more translations, it was only sort of a little feature, and uh, it's all done what I wanted it to. Um, so yeah, uh, I think this video is fine. And yeah guys, I hope you've all enjoyed this sort of uh, seven part series, or six part, or whatever it is, on just me showing you the whole development process of um, my operating system. Now. I haven't done tutorials on it, but I've done some for various applications, but not as the thing as a whole. So, using like uh, various things that you, you pick up using Visual Basics, you can uh, learn to make these other applications and make it really cool. So yeah, thanks guys for watching, and if you like this uh, operating system and the video, subscribe please. And uh, yeah, if you want to help help with anything subscribing liking and favoriting or flavoriting as i like to call it uh that's all good and it makes a huge difference guys so if you could do that that'd be great so yeah thanks guys for watching and i'll see you all next time